I took like a step out into the road and looked around and it, it was literally like, it was a nightmare. It was a nightmare that came true. There were just like piles, piles of people like hovering. Um, it was, it was madness. It was chaos. If you've ever heard a car crash, you know what I'm talking about. However, this wasn't metal on metal. This was human on metal. In a situation like this where you, it should be an absolute joyous event and the control is taken away from you and you just feel powerless, it's terrifying. It is absolutely terrifying. I'm grateful that my daughter, you know, is, is so young and I, I, I'm hoping that she doesn't remember much of this. She, you know, talked about a bad guy yesterday and it was an accident and she hasn't talked about it much since, but we had a little bit, you know, a little boy with us that was a little bit older and he's not okay. We decided to do something um, to make sure that the community knows that we're um, with them through the hurt too. Baksha is a really tight community and I think we I think we knew maybe 40% of the people at that parade in some way or somehow. It was, it was such an innocent event and you didn't know whether to like fight or flight in a sense, like get your family home safe or help these people, help these people that are just sprawled in the middle of the road. We are all in this together. We are Waukesha strong. May God bless and keep you all.